Dr. Shetty. Uh, in the last class, we discussed about you know websites, right? Uh, today, we are going to discuss about the CSS animations. Okay. Uh, actually, in CSS, animation plays you know major role. Okay. So let's see how to uh, make some animations in CSS. I have an example already. Uh, in this video, we are going to discuss about this animation. So in this video, I'm not discussing exactly. Uh, how animation looks and all. I mean, uh, what are the basic properties, the background information. Uh, for this, you have to know the CSS transformation property. Uh, that will discuss later. First, we'll see, uh, you know, how to make this kind of animation. Okay, so in this video, we discuss how to develop this kind of animations. Okay, uh, so for this, I have opened my. So let me just load any local folder. I'll do one thing. I'll just create. A folder, something called CSS animation. So let me open this folder in the web store. So copy this. So let me just load this folder. So file open paste. Okay, okay. Yeah. So I have loaded this empty folder, and in this folder I need this two files. One is HTML file, one CSS file. So let me just create one HTML. So new HTML that is uh, something CSS uh, animation. Okay, so one HTML and one CSS file. So right click new style sheet that is styles. That. So let me just connect both. So let me just connect some link. So link type rel equal to style sheet and the href is style.css okay uh, let me change the title a little bit so css animation okay so here first of all let me start the live server this for live reload so live minus server space minus minus port is equal to 9000 so i enter this command so my live server has been started let me open my html yeah, this is my HTML and we're going to convert like this. Okay, so now let's start about uh, here. So first of all, these I, know, I need to make this kind of circles. So these circles, you can just, you know, better go for one URL tag in that some list items. I'm going to make some, uh, some six list items. I'll go for a shortcut. So L I star six tab. Okay. So in this nothing to mention, I mean uh, we don't need to write anything here, we just need the, the circles, okay. So these dots, okay. So let me add some styles for this in a style.css. So go to style.css, so for my ul tag let me give some margin and all, the same margin top, margin top some 100 pixels, okay. So left, so margin left 100 pixels. Yeah, here is fine. And next, uh, for each list item of UL, I'll just do one thing: UL space li. So for all the list items, uh, what we add? Uh, this add some width, uh, some ten pixels, and the height ten pixels, and uh, they say display them in line block in a straight line as boxes. Oh, color not given. Let me give some background color black. So I get the boxes like this. Okay. So I want the boxes to be rounded. So simply just say border radius some 50 percent. I got the border radius like this. And let me give the space around that's uh, margin. So margin some 30 pixels margin all the sides. Yes, I got the circles. Okay. So for these circles, some it should glow okay so glowing means there is a property called in transformation css3 transformation there is something called scale okay so let's see how to add the scale property here uh, so before that uh, i'm going to start with the animation uh, uh, for this li so you can add animation like this just say animation there's a property called animation uh, here first you have to mention uh, the name of the animation so what is the name of the animation is something called glow is my name of the animation and then duration i need just uh, one second duration and then infinite and then linear 
So, what is this is, is a shortcut property I have applied animation, first name of the animation and this is duration. So, how much duration your animation should affect, ok. So, is it 1 second, 2 seconds or 3 seconds, how much time and this is called animation iteration count. What is this iteration count is, so how many number of times your animation should happen, ok. Uh, you want animation to be only just once happen and just stop or else two times you want to make the animation like that. So, you can just give the number. So, if I say infinite, so infinite times is keep you know glowing that is infinite and linear. So, linear means is called actually uh, animation timing function. Uh, what is the timing function is, uh, so what type of timing you want to add for your animation. So, what type of timing is linear means uh, slow start slow end, there are multiple things are there linear, is in, is out, uh, is in, out like that. So, linear means just remember slow start, slow end. If you want slow start, fast end, there is something called is in, is out like that. So, linear means slow start, slow end. So, my animation name is glow for one second duration it should happen and that to infinite number of times it should happen and slowly start and slowly ends ok. Once you make this animation name you have to define some rules. So, how to behave the animation. So, where we mention the rules is you have to add something called edge keyframes, edge keyframes and you have to match exactly same name over here. This is what the syntax to define the rules of animation, edge keyframes name and how does uh, your HTML, your browser knows about uh, uh, what rules to be applied for this animation is C. Connection between my list items and the rules is C. Here I given the name and for that name only I am writing the rules. So, these rules will be applicable only for this particular list items ok. So, here uh, how you make the rules here actually uh, actually how animation movies can be made you know uh, suppose uh, if one person is there he want to jump from one place to another place. So, how exactly uh, simple concept how video can be played ok. We know images right ok. How to convert an images like convert to video is uh, there is like some 30 frames per second. So, 30 frames means there are some 30 images are playing within one second. So, that you can feel like it is a video right. So, one person want to jump from this building to that building. So, each frame they make the person is here and here and here here and lastly here. So, you play all the things in one second uh, video will be play ok. Uh, best example, uh, there is an Hindi movie uh, Tare Jamin Par, right. So, in that movie, uh, most of the people knows about this Bollywood movies. Uh, here, in Tare Jamin Par movie, that kid draws one diagram, right, in the book. Uh, when the teacher opens that book, he slowly opens that pages, right. So, when he slowly open all the pages, the boy is slowly moving out from the family. So, that, that's what the animation, ok. So, we gonna make uh, how to behave these elements. So, how we do is at 0 percent what type of properties you want background color, shadow, whatever and 10 percent how it is, 20 percent how it is, 30 percent, 40 percent like that 100 percent. So, you just play all the things in a given timing duration. So, what happen you can feel like animation, you can feel like movie ok. Same concept in sys animations also. So, let us see what is this. So, I want at 0 percent some rules ok. So, I just want to say just transform scale there is a property called uh, transform and value is scale, scale means just uh, zoom ok. So, e here it expects two numbers one is width and one is height I will say some 0 0.3 and 0 0.3. So, just reduce the the width of it just check what happened see it is just glowing slowly right ok. Next uh, I want uh, some 25 percent. So, for 25 percent I say the transform what type of transformation I want to scale 5 times width to 5 times height it is an it is like number ok. So, 0 0.3 means 30 percent reduction uh, actually the concept is if you give less than one value it reduces the width and height if you give equal to one no change if you give more than one value here it is like increases. So, 5 times increment for width and height. So, just check once 0 percent is like this, 25 percent is like this. See, now these elements are just glowing ok. 
so i want some 50% so you have to make some sort of calculations here i had done all the calculations so just remember these numbers so 0% this much 24% this 25% this much and 50 75 100 all same so let's check what is happening see it is like this okay fine uh, but here all are just glowing at the same time right so i want to give one by one just glow like this one by one right if you want to glow like this one by one you have to give some delay there is something called animation delay uh, let's give delay for each element each list item okay so how to give the delay is ul space list item colon nth child of one for the first child uh, i just say animation delay there is something called delay just 0 0.1 second and i don't like the all background color see some delay happen for the first one okay so for this one let me add some background color uh, something blue color okay let's add some box shadow uh, 0 0 some 30 pixels uh, blue color only so you get some shade okay fine so let's go for multiple so we have how many one two three four five six six list items so each list item some delay so copy this this is for second third fourth fifth six okay so let me change the delay and the color this is for second list item two seconds duration delay uh, something called red color and this is also red color next this is third one uh, 0 0.3 seconds delay uh, something called green color this is also green color and this is uh, 4 0 0.4 seconds and this is uh, some purple color and this is purple color and 0 is of i 0 0.5 seconds delay and this is something called yellow color and this is also yellow color and this is uh, 6 0 0.6 seconds this is uh, something blue given yeah blue all given green given red given uh, something orange red okay so this also orange red now save it just check yes so you got this but it is very fast uh, you can reduce this I think I don't want this uh, one second just make some 0 0.7 seconds so even faster uh, one minute 0 0.1 2 3 4 5 6 okay let's do one thing some two seconds will give so slowly this works okay fine but I want to add some border for each uh, this glow effect so let me add some little border so border some two pixels uh, solid and white color border so see now they are glowing like slowly so you can give the animation delay so that it's glows like this okay so that's about uh, the animations of CSS so this is what example okay so you can just practice on this and uh, going forward in the next videos we'll just see uh, uh, some interesting animations of css right thank you so much for watching happy coding have a nice day thank you